Well, it's that time of year. My praying mantis egg cases came. And I always get them from uh, We Got Bugs. They do such a nice, you know, kind of a special touch in their packaging. I really like that. Different stickers and so forth. But uh, right now it is uh, May 29th, and I'm here in Minnesota. And uh, this is the perfect time to get your uh, egg cases out. The weather is uh, definitely warming up, and there's plenty of prey insects out there for these fellas to eat. So this is what a praying mantis egg case looks like. The real name is a Uthaka. So let me just uh, show you here. So what happens is you hang this, you know, by a tr under. I usually do them in a, like a bush so they're protected. And uh, just hang it, and you want to spray it just a few times. Uh, I would say probably every other day, because you don't want it to be super dry. Uh, you know, if it gets rained on, hey, no big deal. That's part of nature. But eventually what's going to happen is you're going to have a whole bunch of baby praying mantises that will emerge from this uh, egg case. And what they do here, I, I let them, I guess I just hang from the tree. They give you twist ties and uh, directions on, on how to hatch them. But another option is they give you this bag where you can you put the egg case in the bag and then hang the bag from the tree. And then um, that way the little praying mantis nips will remain in the bag so you can see them. So, you know, in case you've never seen it before, or, um, you know, that, that's also a great way. But, uh, yeah, this is We Got Bugs, and she... Critter Girl, I believe, is, is the name she goes by. Yeah, real nice. But uh, if you go to eBay, you can purchase these. And uh, but I, I highly recommend just put one in the cart and get rid of all your, not all yours, but they sure help in uh, getting rid of the destructive pests, garden pests. So please, if you have a, you know any questions or uh, want to know how to hatch these, Please leave a you know leave a comment below. I'd be more than happy to uh, answer any questions you have. I also have a website with a whole bunch of articles on how to hatch these. Oh, and by the way, these are Chinese praying mantis. Um, probably the most common one you're going to find here if you order them online. Uh, there are some Carolina mantis. You'll see those occasionally as well as European, but. Most of the mail order stuff is Chinese mantis. And uh, they live just, you know, for one year, this will hatch. Uh, in Minnesota, they will be able to grow to maturity, to adult size. Hopefully they'll mate and uh, produce these egg cases. But uh, then they'll die off, uh, obviously, before the snow comes. But yeah, I uh, can't wait. Hopefully within about a week or so, I can uh, I'll have a video with these uh, hatching. Take care, make it a great day.